Welcome back. It's Plasma 1945, and we are looking at some real footage that looks too real and crisp, apparently released by the People's Liberation Army of China. You're watching a rare formation flight of the Chengdu J-20, China's premier fifth generation stealth fighter. In recent years, the J-20 has moved from a mysterious prototype to a key part of the People's Liberation Army Air Force. It now represents one of the most advanced stealth aircraft in active service outside of the United States. The origins of the J-20 trace back to the late 1990s under a classified program known as Project 718. At the time, China was focused on bridging the gap between its fourth generation fighters and the next leap in air combat capabilities. Chengdu Aircraft Corporation was chosen as the lead developer. Its task to create a stealth platform capable of competing with the American F-22 Raptor and to do so on an accelerated timeline. The J-20 made its first public flight on January 11, 2011 during a visit by U.S. Secretary of Defense Robert Gates to Beijing. The timing, whether deliberate or not, sent a clear signal to the West. By 2017, the aircraft had entered limited operational service and since then has seen several major upgrades, including new radar systems, cockpit displays, and even changes to its engine configuration. One key feature of the J-20 is its low observable profile. But modern stealth isn't just about radar. In this footage, the J-20s appear to be wearing a highly reflective surface treatment, similar to what's seen on the latest upgraded F-22 Raptors. This isn't just cosmetic. These coatings are believed to reduce the aircraft's infrared signature, making it harder to detect using IRST systems and heat-seeking missiles. Modern air forces are increasingly relying on infrared search and track systems to detect stealth aircraft without using active radar. By diffusing or redirecting thermal emissions, this coating may help the J-20 remain hidden even from passive sensors. Let's take a closer look at its specifications. The J-20 is a twin-engine multi-role stealth fighter with a focus on long-range interception and beyond visual range engagements. It's significantly larger than both the F-22 and the Russian Su-57, which suggests a secondary emphasis on fuel capacity, range, and possibly internal sensor payloads like targeting pods or jamming equipment. It features an ESA radar, advanced data links, and a glass cockpit with digital flight displays. Its main weapons are stored internally to reduce radar cross-section. These include PL-15 long-range air-to-air missiles, which some analysts suggest have a range advantage over the American AIM-120. For years, the J-20 relied on Russian AL-31 engines, which lacked the performance needed for true supercruise. But more recent variants are now equipped with China's own WS-10C, and the high-thrust S-15 engine is expected by 2026. With thrust vectoring, supercruise, and reduced thermal emissions, the J-20 could soon match the maneuvering envelope of other fifth-gen platforms. In terms of fleet size, the numbers are growing quickly. As of mid-2025, it's estimated that China has produced over 250 J-20s, with new aircraft rolling off the production line monthly. That's more than double the number of operational F-22 Raptors, which remain capped at around 120 combat-ready units following the end of U.S. production in 2011. Russia's Su-57, meanwhile, has struggled to scale. Despite entering service in 2020, only about 20 to 25 aircraft are believed to be in regular flight status, with many still in prototype or test configuration. So where does the J-20 stand in comparison? While the F-22 still leads in raw kinematic performance and stealth pedigree, the J-20 offers range, growing fleet size, and production momentum. The Chengdu J-20 is no longer just a technological experiment. It's a frontline asset, one that is flying regular patrols, escorting strategic bombers, and appearing 
in more and more frontline deployments across China's theater commands. Its evolution is far from over. Future variants may include two-seat versions, loyal wingman integration, or even strike-focused loadouts for precision ground attack. For now, this formation flight reminds us that stealth aircraft are no longer limited to just a few nations. The J-20 is flying in numbers and it's here to stay. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like, subscribe, and check the comments for related topics and analysis.